Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Borderlands 2. This time we're doing the fight for Sanctuary DLC. I have no idea where we are. I, I fast traveled here to where I said the fight for Sanctuary and then just dropped me off here. Isn't this where, when the city like flew off, like wasn't this an area that I can go into? Yep, it's strongly recommended you can play Borderlands 2 to avoid spoilers. Well, we already did that, so don't worry. We're good. Yeah, it's the back of the Crimson Raiders headquarters. Hello, old friend. Been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> I bet you're wondering what the game of our vault hunters. It's Let the squad. Tell you a story. Aw, Krieg, I love Krieg. After the death of Handsome Jack and the fall of Hyperion, Pandora was at peace. As much as it ever was. <laughs> their mission complete, the Crimson Raiders set their sights beyond the stars. You remember the Vault Key, right? It had that map with all the crazy floating holograms. The Vault Hunters believed it would take them to vaults across the galaxy. Of course, sometimes when you're busy looking forward, you forget to watch your back. I do not understand why we haven't left Pandora yet. We are nowhere closer to finding the vaults. This map is the most important scientific discovery in all of human history, and Mordecai is using it as a coaster. Does that matter? We don't even know which planets these are yet. I don't like flying blind. Sanctuary's holding together using spit and wishful thinking. She's barely staying in the air, let alone leaving the planet. Oh, Jesus. We gotta do something. People are talking about disbanding the Raiders, saying Pandora don't need us now that Jack's gone. We need a leader. She don't want the job, man. And can you blame her? Sometimes when you're the one calling the shots, people get hurt. Not making a choice is still a choice. So then, we have no plan, no working ship, no leader, and a soda can on the vault key! Lil, we need to make a call. What do you think? Ellie? That ain't the entrance, Lil. This is Lilith. Sanctuary is under attack. All civilians evacuate the city immediately. Crimson Raiders, to me! This is our home! Push them out! Okay, I guess we're just starting now, huh? Oh god, Private Jessup is now dead. New Pandoran Pyro? Oh, you're dead. You guys aren't that much of a threat, but Jesus. Hey, okay. I'll take that real quick. One, two. Three, four. Oh god, you actually have some shield. Hello, boy. Good block of everything, huh? Easy chance. Do me a favor. Real quick. Ooh, what is going on out here, man? Oh, I can shoot the ships. Oh, you see, that makes sense now. Oh, whoa, hey, chill, my guy. You need to relax yourself. What the? Whoa, 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 chill. What is this? Breathe it in, Mordecai. Damn, they're after the vault key. <sighs> Lilith, there's too many of these pendejos. This is Lilith. All Crimson Raiders, fall back to HQ. 
Just tell me where to point this some bitch. Come on. Time to change the world. Who sold is this? <laughs> like, who sold is this? That was interesting, to say the least. Okay, so we got these coming down with us. You all right, killer? I got as many people off sanctuary as I could, but it was kind of a rush job. Looks like we scatter the Crimson Raiders around the area. Those weren't bandits that attacked us. They were trained soldiers. And that gas, it turned people into monsters. At ease, cowards. This is Colonel Hector of the new Pandora Army. You can stop running now. I already got what I wanted. Sanctuary and the Vault Key are mine once again. <laughs> Honestly, I was hoping for more of a fight. I mean, yo got completely outmaneuvered. What happened to you, Crimson Raiders? Seems without your man rolling, y'all turn into a pack of baby racks with your tail barbs tucked between your talons. <clears throat> so here's what happens now. You've seen what my paradise gas did to your people. Next up, all of Pandora. Sure, it'll kill everyone on the planet, but every garden needs its fertilizer. Well, he's a dickhead. But he's right. Roland never would have let this happen. Man, these are some ugly looking skags. Oh, and they explode. Hey, don't infect me though. Don't infect me though. I don't need that stuff in my life. Thank you. I don't care about that mission item. I'll look for that later. Let's uh, push on. What the Get the tendril out of here. Need enough hentai to know where that's going. And I ain't wanna single hey! I want part of it. Excuse you? Great, you can just throw this stuff at us now. Talking. Uncle Toenails? Mama Panstein? Scratchy Scratch! Oh, not you two. You were the toughest one of all. So whoever this guy is, he's just infecting random psychos and midges trying to ow. Trying to kill me, huh? So get your poison ivy looking thing out of here. So, so I'm basically up against Poison Ivy as an old man. Hey, more of these things you got, man. Some sort of clown 
own theme novelty bar, enjoying weak old pizza and watered down booze. It's a hell of a lifestyle, folks, but it made you soft. Hey, now, wait a minute. My experience in Army Rocks from the top down. I led my people up from ruin, gave them something to believe in. That's why they follow me. We are new Pandora. We're the men who split our backs on the promise of paradise, but it was stolen from us. Now we're taking it back. Starting with your ship and your key. Now, First of all, paradise is coming. And if I have to choke the life out of every last person on this planet to get there, then that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> you don't get to roast Moxie. Nobody roasts Moxie. Her bar is not clown themed. So get that garbage out of here. Oh, they're up there. Fudge sickles. Alright, bruiser. All of y'all, just do me a favor. Take this and die. There we go. Put you out your misery. You better? Who's this? Dude, you have no ammo. Um, uh, Vaughn, your new bandit, bro. Uh, okay. Hello, Vaughn? Easy, easy! <laughs> hey, let's not get all shooty at me, okay? Uh, my name is Vaughn. Uh, now I know we're supposed to be like, you know, mortal enemies or whatever, but... I don't know, the enemy of my plant monster enemy, right? Sure. Hey, looks like Hector kicked you out of your home too, huh? Well, I guess we better join forces. Hmm. Welcome to my camp. The Backburner! Huh? Look, Hector's vine freaks could be back at any moment. We better secure camp, Vault Hunter. The Backburner's firewall got knocked down. And I'm talking an actual wall of fire. We gotta reset the security relays to get that firewall to flame in. You know, uh, I actually opened a vault once. Went from Hyperion accountant to vault uh, guy to bandit war chief. It's a long but very touching story. Hey, I'll tell you about it sometime over some questionably sourced meat. Me and my bandit clan were living over in the wreckage of Helios Station, then Hector shows up and ordered us to give him our moonshot cannons, but we said, hell no, we won't, bro. And then that, that didn't work out too well. We tried fighting off Hector's new Pandora soldiers, but we were no match for him. I probably should have armed my clan with more than presentation-grade Hyperion laser pointers. <laughs> Lesson learned, I guess. Me and the survivors regrouped here. We were getting ready to retake Helios when Hector launched a gas attack and turned everyone but me into Vine Freaks. Now that dude Hector's walking around like he's Mega President King of Pandora or whatever. You know, Pandora's like air or meat or underwear. Meant to be shared. See, I was not paying a, a, a single iota of attention to what he was saying just now. But is Vaughn the guy from Tales of the Borderlands? Because if so, I'm definitely going to play that game at least once. I've only seen, uh, I think it was Jack Septic guy that was playing Tales from the Borderlands. And I saw, hey, I saw his playthrough of it. I just saw it a million years ago. So I might have to refresh my memory on that one. Nice! Now you can reboot the last relay. We'll have that old firewall a flame in no time. And if any of my clan survive, they'll come running when they see a fire. They always do. It's hilarious. Don't tell me I have to kill your clan, buddy. Hector, you and I are gonna mess that dude up. Blood 
Anyway, here's Firewall. <laughs> That's a good one. I like that one. That's a good one. All right, you've cleared out the camp called Backburner. New ally named Vaughn. Mutated. Uh. All right, let's talk about getting Sanctuary back, buddy. What's up, killer? Good work finding a camp. Guess this will be our home while we figure out how to take back Sanctuary. Uh, this is my camp? Hey, Lil. Step back if you don't want to get any bandit on you. Easy, easy! <laughs> we can share! Hey, want to take a spin in my lucky underwear? I'm listening. I'm gonna teleport back um, to Sanctuary and try to take Hector out. Ellie and Vaughn? There's still time to fix this. Hmm. That's a thing, I guess. <coughs> Not gonna happen. I can't get to him. Sanctuary's flooded with that gas. Tannis, can you, I don't know, whip us up an antidote? Of course. I will first need to discover the nature of these mutations. Send me some plant genitalia. I believe they are called flowers at your reading level. What she said. Wow. Let's get it done. Look, ma'am, I know you need some stamens and pistols. That is indeed what they are called. Do not attempt to slander my reading level. I read at a sixth grade reading level. Thank you. Flowers. Who does she think I am? Did she think I'm freaking Vaughn up there? Ah. Let's see. Okay, I need some some stamens and pistols. Oh, I gotta go. Oh, I gotta leave. All right. Well, I guess we're leaving. I'm gonna have to agree with Tannis. I'd rather have an army. Because we got one Vault Hunter at the moment. I mean, unless we canonically include the rest of them in it. I don't know if that's how that works. But we got one Vault Hunter, namely me. Let's teleport to the vehicle. So we got me. And, you know, Roland's obviously gone. Hey, chill. Die, thank you. Got myself, Roland's gone. Lilith, she's not allowed to die because she's apparently the commander of Sanctuary now. Mordecai, and we haven't seen Brick yet. So, what we're left with is myself and Mordecai. So, this is going to be quite the battle if we're only expecting to go with only three people. I don't trust anything that's just hanging like that. Because I always expect it. Chapter two. Oh. Jack was a kitty. Chapter three. My boys oh, wow. found out the stalkers don't cloak so well once their shields are down. They get all panicky, start roaring to power up their friends. It's cute. I saw a huge stalker staring at our camp the other day. I had decided to name her Henry, you know, after oh, hold up a second. Hmm. Hey, Mom! No, I was just saying I named a stalker after you. See, I didn't mean to pick up those mission things, but I guess that happened. Let's go find those flowers. Jeez. Let me guess, at the top of this hill somehow. Of course it is. Always gotta be at the top or bottom of something. You find yourself hitting harder while fighting within a gas pocket. Strange, but potentially helpful. 
Do keep a close eye on your exposure level. Unless sprouting vines and losing your mind is a newfound kink. In which case, I have some echo novels for your perusal. Judgment free zone. Alrighty. Closed vaults. I need pure specimens. Interesting thing, Tannis. The local fauna as well. Vault Hunter, try obtaining samples from those infected skags. Right, lock and reload. You're gone. You're gone. Oh. I'm gonna stay right at the border because. I don't know how this is gonna last. Come on, come on, come on. Run through, run through, run through, run through. Okay, so I need to be inside that cloud. Alright, well. Oh, hey, there's a whole new bar up there. I just saw that. Well, deeper I go, I guess. Thanks, Dennis. Plants are enormous, even by Pandoran standards. It's unlikely that this gas is naturally occurring. Someone engineered it. You think? The gas has been elegantly designed to increase biomass at an exponential rate. In dumb speak, gas make tiny plant go big, big, and do the ouch. Uh huh. Thanks. I guess. Oh, wait, wait, I found a thing back here. A loot nest? Ow. Oh, God. What Ooh, you dropped something orange. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Get me out of here. Out, 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 out. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down, calm down. Whatever the hell you were. Like some slime thing. Just walking up like it was all good too. It was like, hi, I'm I'm a I'm back. Hey little mama, let me whisper in your ear type thing. I'm like, what the yo? I'm like, yo, back off. I don't roll that way. I ain't into plant monsters, I'm good. Aha Dang it, tennis. Just remind me to shoot you in the face next time I see you. Thought you'd actually gain something useful from the infected skags, but no. Where's the last flower then? Found it. Jesus, who's hiding from me? This gas would require an understanding of advanced biogenetics I can only describe as brilliant. Now we must discern how the gas is infecting humans. I will require samples, specifically brain matter, which I like to call that good gray stuff. That good gray stuff. I mean, you're not wrong. It is gray matter. But, uh, <laughs> Tennis, you need to chill. You can't just say talking about, you know, that type of stuff turns you on. Ain't nobody trying to find out your kinks. I know you, you said it's a judgment-free zone, but I'm definitely judging you. Right, so I need to kill some infected people, I guess. Goodbye. I can't even see where you're shooting me from. There you are. See, I have no idea what she said, but I'm sure she said something funny. So I'll just highlight that in the video. And let's see, we got one, two, wait, there's three. Nope. Nope.
Where are my infected boys? Where are my sick boys? Come on, sick boys. There's a sick boy. A big sick boy. Sick boy dead dead. Listen, behave yourselves, child. Oh, you're still dead. Anyone else like to mess with me? Oh, a breakthrough! We all know that the Pandoran atmosphere is chock full of benign spores. The gas mutates the spores already present in our lungs. Oh, wonderful. The spores spread to the brain, taking over the nervous system. The subjects are left nearly mindless, like a slag hub addict or a music enthusiast. Like a what enthusiast? I have disappointing news. I lack the expertise necessary to synthesize. Hmm, new skin. Gas ...and create our own legions of plant-human hybrids. Again, not doing that. You sound just like that university ethics board. No matter. Return to the back burner and send me those samples. I'm running out of iridium, so I'm gonna make one last sweep for survivors. See you back at camp. <gasps> one of you guys dropped iridium up here somewhere. What a oh, Jesus. Dissect it with your weapon of choice. Like I always say, the more horrifying specimens, the merrier. What creature? First of all, y'all need to stop. I said kill the creature. Is there a creature in here? What the hell? Okay, note to self, don't kill infected things. They kind of hurt. a science kink you know she's like oh, there's nothing between my skin and this biohazard suit uh. all right tennis we're just gonna never mention that again they said I saw Vaughn in here oh there he is oh that's on me yeah um, I was scanning my glutes for reasons and uh, and I busted the science thing <laughs> just give it a little bandit high five <laughs> Find a way back up to Sanctuary. Nice. Yo, Lilith. Me and Tylen got a nice perch up by Mount Scarab. We might have found a way up to Sanctuary. Mordecai. Good to hear from you. Uh, I wasn't gonna let you fight this one without me. Oh, crap! Brace yourselves! Bunch of Hector Salad Soldiers are headed your way! Salad Lily, Soldiers? Time for a fight! Those defenses ready? Way out here in the middle of nowhere, nowhere. Don't tell me to get you a fucking bash wrench from way up out here. Did Scooter die? Well, we got a picture of Scooter, but... What the f... I need to look into what happened. Because clearly I missed a few things. Repair turrets. Oh, they're out here. Scheiße. Oh, those are the turrets I walked past. Right, let's fix them up then. 
I'm gonna actually hit E. turrets alone I might not be the commando but that doesn't mean you get to take out my turrets and look at that not a single oh See, this is why I gotta go play Tales from the Borderlands now. I gotta see if I can find that on sale. I mean, I could probably find it dirt cheap considering uh, that studio went under, which is a shame because they're the only ones that made story games. Uh, Telltale games, that's what they were called. They're the only studio that was making story-based games. At least kind of like that where the choices actually matter and stuff like that. Hey, look. Talon. Yo. Talon. He's all grown up. Good Talon. Poor Scooter. No, that means Scooter died, man. Don't like that. Alright, Talon, you gonna go somewhere, buddy? Oh, he did the same flexing. I guess we're going down here. Still haven't heard from Mordecai. Keep following Talon. We've lost too much already. We can't lose Mordecai. He's the best scout in the Raiders. We've been fighting together since the beginning. Alright, y'all gone. The same flex. Mordecai, Brick, Roland. We had each other's backs. We fought together. That's how we survived for so long. When Roland died, Mordecai got me some dark times. Couldn't have taken down Jack without him. The Crimson Raiders wouldn't be the same without Mordecai. <gasps> What are you even dropping? Like a hand? Skag tongue. Oh, 
There. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, there's a switch. Are right, you new Pandoran Skaglicks? It's go time. Montage music. No scope required. There we go. <coughs> oh man. You alright? Lilith! Those pendejos crapped us in me. Damn it! Mordecai's infected! <laughs> My fault. We need that antidote now! I'll take him back to camp. Get through that mine and find the scientist. Excellent. I eagerly await your arrival. Good luck at that old doll mine. I heard that place was haunted. <gasps> Cursed haunted. There's some health. Alright. Let's go ahead and go through the doll mine, and I think that'll be the end of this episode. So we'll finish out like whatever's going on inside the mine. Don't you dare have a friggin' Varkid in there. I don't trust you. Oh, Talon, are you? Okay, you're going back with them. Okay. I was like, is Talon going to follow me? Are we going to have a buddy? There we go. Good enough. Now let's go. Oop. Open the door. leave my flank exposed to counterattack? That's basic military strategy. Boy. I'll reinforce that door with three feet of solid titanium, you dum dums. Point Hector. This guy's a four star asshole, but again, he's right. That gate's too thick for me to phase through. Come on back to camp and we'll figure it out. Alright, I guess we're not going through the doll mining facility. Let's go ahead and head back to camp then. Whenever it says we're at chapter 3, I think this one will end it. I was gonna end it through there, but I guess not. Oh, Jesus. This thing handles like garbage. Thank you, Hyperion Turrets. What? What are you shooting at? Oh, the car. I was like, what are you shooting at? There's no plant things here. Oh, I guess this is the end of the mission. If it says chapter three, then yeah. I mean, we did do pretty, we did do pretty well this episode. Got through two chapters already, I think. Possibly, maybe.
We need to punch through that gate somehow. Cassius is our only chance of saving Mordecai and retaking Sanctuary. Tritanium's chunky stuff, Lil. Gonna take one hell of a weapon, and what we got here ain't gonna cut it. <coughs> Yo, Lilith! What about the Helios moonshine? Yeah, that could work. Bandit, you lived on Helios for a while. Think we can get the moonshot cannon working? Oh yeah, totally! But, just so you know, to get into Helios, you're gonna have to go through... ...the burrows. Have fun, don't die! I don't uh, love I mean, Jack's weapons, but if it gets the job done, I can live with it. Oh man! This is exciting! Surviving the burrows is, is a bandit rite of passage! You know what, if you make it through, you can be my vice war chief. All right, so we're going to go ahead and leave this episode off here. So unfortunately, Mordecai's out of commission. Lilith can't do squat right now. And Ellie's just Ellie. So we got to go ahead solo style through the burrows, wherever that is, and find the doctor dude. So that way we can save Mordecai and retake Sanctuary. But I digress, guys. We're going to leave this episode off here. We'll take that all that on on the next episode of Let's Play Borderlands 2. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of Borderlands 2's version of a pre-sequel DLC thing before Borderlands 3 because when Borderlands 3 comes out I'm hopping right onto that train and I'm playing it so other than that guys I will catch you all here next time I hope you all have a great and wonderful day